Greetings from the UK and to Kim's uh, Discovering History channel. Um, I'm at Desbra Airfield. Um, sometimes it was called RAF Desbra. Uh, but basically this airfield was used for training. Uh, 84 Squadron Training Unit uh, was based here. Uh, back in 1943 to 1946 of which then it was closed down um, but the uh, the building behind me I don't know if you can see it uh, is one of the old existing hangars that still stands to this day but is used by uh, agriculture uh, farmers etc and um, a lot has changed on this airfield to what it used to be uh, in its day back in 1943. The hangers were a T2 type hanger. Um, I'm not fully conversed with uh, different types of hangers. Uh, I'll admit to you that I actually found that on the internet. <clears throat> I've read it up, Google it, you'll see what T2 is if you want to find out what it means. I haven't got a clue because I've not gone that far. Um, but um, the big. What used to be based here, uh, for obviously training purposes, was the Wellington bomber. And the occasional Dakota was thrown in. And I'm guessing they were used primarily to uh, ferry people from uh, one airfield to another around the UK. Uh, supplying trainees, potential trainees, uh, to train up for the war effort and being able to fly a Wellington bomber. And of course, when I come to these airfields, I often think to myself, uh, sort of a sombre thought really, awaiting the call to go out, take off in their bombers on a bombing raid to Germany and wondering if they're ever going to come back. Um, and as we know, there were a number of occasions that they didn't come back, which is uh, quite somber, really.
okay that pretty much wraps it up for today um, if you've enjoyed today's video of Desborough Airfield or RAF Desborough um, please give it a thumbs up and show of your appreciation and if you want to see more of my videos then hit that uh, red subscribe button below and uh, if you want to keep notified ring the bell and you'll be notified of all my forthcoming videos uh, on YouTube so uh, I wish you well and uh, hope you enjoy this video see you for now